A5, Abraham and God's promise, or Abraham and God's promise, Genesis 11, 12 and 15. If you are Christ, then you are Abraham's offspring, he is according to promise, Galatians 3, 29. Noah taught his sons about God and the world. His sons had sons and grandsons of their own. One of these grandsons of grandsons was named Abraham. God had a special plan for Abraham. One day, God told Abraham to leave his home. God promised that Abraham would have a family that would become a great nation. I will bless you and make your name great so that you will be a blessing. In you, all the families of the earth shall be blessed. Genesis 12, 2 to 3. But what is a blessing? Any ideas? A blessing is a gift of goodness from God, a part of his plan to bring us closer to him. God promised to bless Abraham, and then through Abraham, all the families on the earth would have that goodness too. That was a big, important promise. Abraham tried to believe God's promise. He took his wife and all his possessions and went where God told him to go. But many years passed, and still he and his wife had no children. God knew Abraham was afraid, so he spoke from again. God told Abraham to look up and count all the stars shining in the sky. He told Abraham that his family would be as many as the numbers of stars in the sky. Yeah. And Abraham stopped being afraid and believed God again. Have you ever had to wait a long time for something? Yep. What? My birthday. I knew you were going to say that. My birthday. And your birthday. And to go to Rainbow birthday. Yeah. What do you want to do when you are waiting? Do you? You want to try and make it okay, go so faster, right? Eh? getting presents. <laughs> okay. Yeah, all done. Done.